Quick, guys, super hands, high five! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Yay! Woo! <laughs> Alrighty, hello, hello everyone. Today is Monday, that means we've got another haul video for you guys. We've got some pretty cool stuff over here and a bunch of junk over there. We'll, we'll uh, dive in in just a moment here. First, we're going to cover these sets. These appear to be sealed. We've got an assembly square, which is a very nice modular. It's actually uh, several years old now. You can see it's got those old classic smiley faces still on the characters. But nonetheless, an amazing architectural build. I actually um, own this one. It's really cool. So we'll be putting that one out for sale very soon. It should be, uh, I believe, retail price. I don't think it's discontinued yet. Once it discontinues, it will probably rise in price, but right now it's fine. Here's another very cool set. It's the uh, City Main Square set. This one I've actually never seen in the store. It's got the um, fake monorail. It, it looks like a monorail train. It looks great, but there's no track with it, so you'd have to build the track. You got the really cool City Diner. Um, you got the limousine, you got the police chase going on in Town Square. Um, you've got the mayor in his corn outfit. I think that's just hilarious. There's a seagull trying to bother him. So a lot of stuff going on in that city set. That is pretty awesome. And it's even got the cool Build Together logo. That's fun. All right, and then behind this, looks like somebody traded in two Monkey Kid sets. You've got the Legendary Flower Fruit Mountain. And if there's any Lego set that I would describe as like Zen, this is it. It's got some really cool pieces, really cool slopes and angles. That waterfall is gorgeous. You've got the monkey kid and the, I think that's the villain macaque. What's his name? Evil macaque, yes. He is uh, probably attacking the monkey king and the monkey kid um, on their special mountain. Look at that cool crane too. Very cool, very nice set. And we'll be putting those out for sale soon. All right, and we just got stuff piled on the table and on the floor nearby over here. Um, we're gonna try to dissect this as carefully as possible. Don't want anything to fall over. Um, over here, you've got what looks like a used, well, no, maybe some of it's sealed or partially sealed, kind of newish NXT 2.0. So very cool Mindstorm set. Those still work pretty well. Um, you gotta get the right uh, versions and stuff on the software, but it's pretty cool. You got a Kylo Ren box, uh, ATSD Raider box, a couple of Ninjago boxes. Those look like boxes. No Lego bricks in there. There's a poly bag, might be open. It looks like a snow speeder. There's a set in box, looks like a little A wing. You got the <laughs> Mindstorms set, which actually in includes no Mindstorms pieces whatsoever, just a little technical robot build set. Still pretty cool. Got a uh, pod racer here. Looks like it's got the stuff inside. I see some minifigures. You've got uh, Ninjago, very fun theme. This is the kind of like the cyber video game version. So very cool. Need to watch that season. I haven't seen that season yet. You got the Black Widow. This is kind of like the limited edition set. Sounds like it's all in there. We'll double check on all that pretty quickly. Yep, the figures are in there, the parts are in there. Might have to make sure all the parts are there, but very cool. We've got a bunch of Star Wars built sets in this bin. You've got in this uh, purple bag here the Razor Crest. So we'll be uh, making sure that's put together enough to put out for sale in the built sets in the Star Wars section. You've got uh, First order snow troopers here on their landing vehicle. You got an ATAT, ATSD Raider. You got a crashed Kylo Ren ship. That one will probably have to be rebuilt or even graveyarded if we feel like we have enough of them out there. So that one's in a little bit less shape, uh, less good quality because it's broken up a little bit. We've got the um, 20th anniversary slave one. Very nice. You've got some good Star Wars figures. You got Kylo Ren, the Sith Trooper, the Knights of Ren, looks like Moff Tarkin. A couple of the figures to go with that set too. That's really nice. And what do we got up here? Looks like a bunch of sets. I wonder if they're nice. Shave a sheep. That is delightful. Look at those sheep. They look so terrified. And there's a big bad wolf. 
Oh my goodness. Maybe you're trying to remove all the, the, the wool off your sheep before your sheep gets eaten. That's a pretty fun. I've never seen that game. Looks like we've got a Friends Central Perk. It's a very cool set. Has all the main characters. You got some Harry Potter. This one actually looks like it might be sealed because the Friends one was open. We've got a clock tower. This one appears to be opened. So those boxes and least has been opened. So um, we often get sets in various stages of condition. Sometimes they're sealed, sometimes they're open. Kind of depends what the original owner was doing with them. Maybe they bought them and there was an extra, they didn't need it. Like here's a sealed one. It's a cool Super Mario Bowser's airship. Designed by Carl Merriam, very cool set. We've got some built and bagged Friends and Disney stuff here. There's a Moana set. This might be another Moana set. Yep, two Moana sets, very cool. You also have the, uh, looks like the water park with some palm trees going on. You've got a, looks like a opened Lego Ideas. Dinosaur Museum set. It's even got Johnny Thunder in skeletal form. Pretty funny. You got, uh, these might be, nope. You got at least partial um, Star Wars sets in the boxes here. Um, we've got quite a few built Friends stuff. I'm seeing some of the old Friends roller coasters and amusement park stuff. Like there's the uh, Ferris wheel. It's pretty cool. There's the, uh, the drop ride. So they rise them up and they spin down. Pretty cool. It's even got the camera for their reactions. These are fun sets. Um, looks like... I'm not sure which one this is, but it's definitely Friends. Looking like the difference between uh, like a ski chalet or a something. Yeah, I think it's for skiing. Because it's got the, the ride. There's the spin around ride with the rockets you can hop into the uh really sparkly classic space logo very cool you've got a city set dumped on top to a construction set that one looks like it's been opened before you've got a creator three in one here the uh rocket truck that's pretty cool this one appears sealed yeah it is, looks like it's sealed maybe it's been opened okay yeah it's been re-taped up so we'll have to check and make sure all the pieces are there like most of the sets here. Looks like we got a couple probably sealed sets here. You got uh, Hermione and Harry Potter, the big build buildable figures, very fun. You got another city set. This looks like the uh, donut shop opening. This is very popular. You've got the city wildlife rescue operation. Looks like they're trying to stop the tree from falling on the baby elephant and the alligator's about to eat the baby elephant, so I don't know how that helps them, but... You got another wildlife rescue camp. I love that tree house. That's pretty cool. You got a little light airplane. That's... Uh, I would have maybe beefed up the engine on that one, but... um, Got some lions. Pretty cool. So those are some nice sealed sets. Those will be out soon, I'm guessing. I think pretty much all those are still retail. Maybe not the Harry Potter one. I'm not sure what the status of that one is. Ooh. You've got a Rancor back here. I think we still had one out for sale. But uh, this one is a, probably a different one. Looks like we've got two now. And he's still got his fingers, which are extremely valuable. Because they are removable and therefore easily lost. So him still having his fingers is great. Because we are always short of Rancor fingers around here, which sounds like a really weird thing. There's a Ninjago Tornado Spinner. Got part of a Hulkbuster. Looks like he's seen better days. General Grievous's ship looks pretty complete. Got uh, some Lego Movie 2 vehicle here. A city building, a pile of instructions. 
a little bit. What's this? Is this a uh, brick heads, maybe? No, no, no. It's not a brick heads. It's a, a carrot house. Very interesting. Looks like it's missing the back wall, unless that's supposed to be like that. No, no, that might be how it's supposed to be. I'll have to look on the set picture and make sure, but that's pretty cool. You've got a Krennic shuttle and a bucket of figures. So looks like some pretty good figures in here. You've got an Old Republic trooper. Maybe two of them. Got uh, Doc Brown. Ooh, 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 hold on. This guy's from Rebels, and his torso is almost always broken, but this one looks like it's in good shape. Even the print looks like it's in good shape, so that'll be out for soon. Uh, out for sale soon, excuse me. I think his name is Zeb. He's got the really cool custom molded, well, not custom, specialty molded head. It looks like a Tobey Maguire Spider-Man here, too. Some really nice figures. We'll have to move that to the figure sorting table. Let John have a look at that, because that's cool. And we had this uh, UCS gunship before. I think it's actually sold. We have another one that uh, Jacob built recently that's uh, going to go out for sale soon, too. So we do have a couple gunships floating around right now. You've got, uh, looks like a Millennium Falcon right here. This looks like an older version of it. Because you got all this opening individual pieces. Yeah, this is a slightly older version of it, but still a good version of it. Got an ATAT -AT up here. Very nice. Got a couple. There's a video. Too bad nobody wants video. Okay. And um, you got some Star Wars. Sounds like it's in there. Looks like it's sealed too. So it's sealed or maybe new ish. Land Speeder. Obi Wan's Hut. I bet you those will be a little more popular with the Obi Wan TV show coming out soon. Got uh, Han Solo, Duel on Mustafar, a couple good small Star Wars sets. And we're kind of back where we began over here, but I wanted to briefly discuss the uh, cool Duplo pieces that we got in here and some friend sets kind of sprinkled in for good measure. That's pretty cool. Piece. Is that like it? It is. Look at that. I've never seen that piece before. That's awesome. Can only imagine what could be made with that if you put system pieces on top. That's pretty cool. Yep. Alrighty, and that is a breakdown of what we got in the hall today. Uh, oh, let me quickly... We've got a cool squid down there, too. We'll have to fix him up. Yeah, that's the haul for this week, guys. We sure appreciate you guys tuning in. We'll have another one next Monday as well as a bunch of other cool videos coming out this week. Uh, we've got Lego Chess, and I think we got Lego Rock Raiders coming up, too. And uh, so don't, don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe buttons. We sure appreciate it. And you guys have an excellent Monday.